Next thing we're going to look at are the orbital considerations for the reaction and their effect on the stereochemistry. So in this case, we have MCPBA. And so this oxidant adds in to the base of the carbonyl. And this is the tetrahedral intermediate that's formed. So notice we have that weak oxygen-oxygen bond. And we have to decide between secondary the group versus the primary, just simply methyl group to migrate. And it will be the secondary group that will migrate preferentially. Now, in order for that group to migrate, we have to have that sigma bond. So look over in the bottom right here. So we have the sigma bond. And that sigma bond is a filled orbital. It has two electrons in it. And of all those orbitals of these bonds, it is the highest occupied molecular orbital, the most reactive, the highest energy orbital. So it's the one that's going to participate in this reaction. Over on the oxygen-oxygen side, what we need now is an empty orbital for those, those two electrons to go into. Electrons will always go into empty orbitals. So what we need over on the right-hand side, that breaking oxygen-oxygen bond, is the sigma star of the oxygen-oxygen. The sigma star is empty, so there are currently zero electrons in it, and it is the lowest unoccupied molecular orbital. Or though I said, it's the one that can react most easily. So in the transition state of, these re of this reaction, the HOMO and the LUMO will overlap, they'll line up, so that the electrons can go from the filled orbital into the empty orbital to form a new bond. Notice in the line drawing that these bonds are parallel. So the nucleophile, which is the red bond, will come in anti-periplanar to the leaving group, exactly the same as we did in the SN2 reaction. This is kind of like an intramolecular SN2 reaction. So as this reaction takes place, lone pair on the oxygen comes down, the nucleophilic electrons from the HOMO migrate over into the LUMO of the oxygen-oxygen bond, and the OO bond breaks. Now because the carbon that held the HOMO was not really reacting, because its electrons are staying in the same position, there's no change in the stereochemistry of that migrating group. So there's a retention of configuration of the migrating group. So the key here is that we have retention of configuration because of the orbital, orbitals that are involved.